Guys, welcome to JerseyBeast.tv. So I got a question from a guy named Robbie. He was kind of interested in how I eat, uh, kind of the breakdown of my daily meals and, and how my diet looks uh, throughout the course of the week. Um, a couple weeks ago, I put up a video talking about how I was going back on a bodybuilding style diet, wasn't fasting anymore, eating breakfast, and um, I guess he wants me to kind of go into that a little bit. So, Robbie, it's pretty simple, bro. It's it's uh, very basic foods. I concentrate on proteins, you know, chicken, fish, beef, ground turkey, uh, healthy fats, and then carbs. Now the secret with the carbs is you wanna kinda cycle them through the week. So typically I have two high carb days during the week. Uh, one day is Monday, the other day is Thursday, right? And I'll get into that in a second. The rest of the days during the week are low carb days. So I eat anywhere from 100 to 150 grams of carbs. And I take that number and I split it up. So half of that amount is eaten at breakfast, the other half is eaten post workout. Because of those time frames, I can get away with eating a little bit of sugar, whether it's fruit or natural honey or, or something to that effect. As long as it's healthy, right? You don't want to eat shit. You know, you want to keep it healthy. So um, split the carbs up from those two meals. And then the rest of the meals consist of healthy fats you know, nuts, olive oil, uh, protein, and uh, um, maybe some vegetables or something like that, okay? The high carb days, Monday and Thursday, I like to eat white rice just because I feel better on white rice. To me, brown rice, I feel kind of shitty. It sits in my stomach weird. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but white rice is good, but because you're only having two high carb days a week, it's not that huge of a deal. Your body is depleted of uh, carbs and glycogen, so you can kind of stock up on white rice or white potatoes or sweet potatoes. Um, starchy carbs, okay? Try and stay away from the veggies on those days. Stock up on, you know, your rices and your, and your potatoes. Um, oatmeal, I guess, is pretty good too. You know, stuff that's going to, that, 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 you know, is starchy, not very fibrous, you know, because uh, fibrous carbs are pretty low on the uh, calorie side. So it kind of works as like a refeed, your body, you eat a little bit more calories on those high carb days. But just make sure, you know, on those high carb days, on my high carb day, I eat about 400 grams of carbs, split up with usually rice or potatoes or rice and potatoes. But you gotta measure it out, okay? On the high carb days too, my protein's a little bit lower than normal, um, just because carbs are, are, are protein sparing, so you don't need as much protein. Um, and then my carbs, my, um, my fat is very minimal on those days because you don't want to eat high carb and high fat because it does something in your body where it makes it, your body easier to store fat with the insulin spikes and that sort of thing. So um, stay away from fat on your high carb days. So that's pretty much the breakdown. It's very easy, um, very simple. I think my protein on my low carb days is about 50 grams per meal. Healthy fats is about 12 to 15 grams per meal, um, and then the high carb days, I eat about, I'm gonna say, 80 grams of carbs per meal with rice or potatoes, and then the carbs, I think, are, I mean, the protein's about 35 grams per meal, something like that, the fat, and the fats, so I try and keep to a minimum, you know, as low as I can. Obviously, you can't, it's really hard to eat zero fat for the day, but just be conscious about it. Uh, and that's pretty much it, as far as calorie counts, I can't really give you a calorie count because I don't know. There's too many variables, you know. Um, we probably train different amounts during the week uh, and your metabolism is probably different than mine. So those are kind of things you'd have to play with and you'd have to get a coach for. But that's the gist of my diet. Uh, hopefully that helps. But again, high carb days Monday and Thursday. Carbs spread throughout the day. Protein a little bit lower. Fat, keep it to a minimum. And then every other day besides that, besides those two, Low carb days, 100 grams to 150 grams, higher protein levels, moderate fat levels, and uh, just remember to split those um, carbohydrate amounts on those low carb days, breakfast and post workout. All right, that's pretty much it. Hopefully that helps you, Robbie, and uh, keep firing away with questions. Later, guys.